Hello. Hello. I just wanted to stop by super, super quickly. I'm about to take my dog for a walk. Um, but I have my makeup on, so I thought, okay, let's do another video. So I have, um, well, um, so I live in Margate. I moved here like two and a half, three years ago. I used to live in East London. And I often get asked, where are the best places to Instagram in Margate? So I'm here and I'm ready to tell you. So number one has to be Dreamland. There is a big wheel, there's loads of fairground rides, there's loads of candy floss, loads of neon signs. <laughs> there's so much to Instagram there. Oh, there's a roller disco, great for a boomerang. What else is a pinball machines? I mean, it's, it's like literally, a roller coaster of Instagram content and boomerangs and videos and gifts and stories. There's so much to Instagram there. From the food to the rides to yourself, there's so much to Instagram there, especially on a sunny day when you get that beautiful blue sea, air, sky thing. So that is my number one place to Instagram. My number two place is the pastel houses on the front. It's no secret, I love a pastel house photo and they are really cute pastel houses right on the front. And also if you go further up the coast towards Palm Bay area, there's some really cute pastel houses up there which are more art deco themed. And there's one which is pink. It literally looks like Malibu Barbie dream house. It's so cute, it's so good, it's so worth walking up if you can be bothered or if you're here for a fair while and you feel like a walk. Also, there are some very good pastel houses in Whitstable and Broadstairs, just so you know. So they're a really fun Instagram. Next, we have GB Pizza, which you've probably seen on my Instagram many a time. It's really cute. It recently got refurbed maybe in the last year. They've got pink parquet metro tiles all across the wall. They've got a neon sign which says, you want a pizza me, like pizza me like the Britney lyric very cute very funny again in pink so it's like pink on pink and then all the benches have green palm print cushions on which are really cute it's also dog friendly in there so you never know you might get a cute snap of a dog eating pizza who knows that's a really cute place to Instagram so there's a great shop called a little bit it's really cute it's in the old town first of all the front of it is white with multicolored polka dots on that's an Instagram in itself then inside there's loads of just cuteness like knitted cactus cute homewares cute jewelry cute clothing just like cuteness 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 the girl who works there is cute herself there's a dog in there like it's just such a cute shop and there's so many things that you could buy in there which you could later use as instagram props i'm just saying i have bought many a thing in there you may have seen them on my instagram that's a really great place all my hair's falling out that's a really cute place to instagram and then we have also a shop called mama which is actually a shop slash coffee shop so cute it how to describe it it's kind of like a plant shop there's loads of cacti all in like multi-colored hand-painted pots which are just super super cute they're made locally so you won't get them anywhere else just it's just this like jungle of cacti and plants set against like pink and white and yellow and red and blue stripes and polka dots and they're just beautiful and it's a lovely shop and it's great coffee you can get coffee and you can take a picture, you can take a selfie against the plants, you can hold your coffee cup up against the plants, there's just loads and loads and loads of places to enter from in there. There's also really cute books and cards and just cuteness in there. It's really lovely. And then I, I'm done, basically. There, they are my five. Wait, let me check. Yes, that's my... <laughs> I had to check. Yes, that's my five. So they are my five top Instagram spots in Margate. And then I'm also going to do a special shout out to the sea because that is always a cute thing to Instagram. There's also beach huts. Oh, that's a really, yeah, I should have had that. That's one of my five. Beach huts, you should totally take an Instagram photo of the beach huts. They are a little bit further up the coast. So when you come out the train station, you turn left instead of right, up left towards Westgate on sea. There's loads of beach huts, probably about a 10 minute walk away from the train station. So many cute beach huts pink, rainbow, multicolored, just so many cute beach huts. I would say Cliffs, which is in Cliftonville, that's a great little place to Instagram. They've got like cute leather sofa, like I know that doesn't sound cute, but really cute leather sofas, really good avocado on toast, just cuteness, cuteness, cuteness. And also we've got the Cupcake Cafe, which makes a really good Instagram picture. So the Harbour Arm, there's like loads of little cute cafes on there. I would say my favorite is Mala Cafe, which is all exposed bricks and plants and coffees and cakes and that's delicious and it's also really pretty to Instagram. But yes, that's my top Instagram spot in Margate and when you're here, look me up. Okay, thank you very much, bye. <laughs>